For around $100, I customized my car to look pretty cool. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can too. One of the best ways to keep your car looking nice is to keep it clean and waxed. That may be pretty obvious to you, but keeping it waxed is really important to keep the paint from looking really bad like you see sometimes out on the street. It's currently raining, but I need it wet anyway, so that doesn't really matter. If I could make sure that you did one thing in this video to your own car, it would probably be the wax. So if you don't regularly wax your car already, I would make sure to do that. Have you noticed that your headlights are super yellow and disgusting? What you need to buy is some headlight polish. So go down to your local car store and get some for yourself. You definitely need to buy yourself some paint pens and draw on some racing tire letters on your tires. Most tires already have some lettering so you can follow that or I went into my special program and made up a little template of my own off of some sticker paper. If you sand your hubcaps, make sure to use fine sandpaper so as to not damage the surface. Read your directions carefully on the paint can before applying the paint. I applied some primer to the rest of my hubcaps to try and get the paint to stick the best I could. There are so many videos on how to vinyl wrap your car on YouTube already, so I'm not going to do that. But if you want to know a little bit more, here are some tips. Number one is, it's pretty cheap for a small amount. It gets really expensive if you want multiple meters. It comes in all sorts of colors and patterns, whatever you like is probably out there. And it's not too hard to apply. A beginner can do it pretty easily. It just takes a long time. I probably chose one of the hardest spots on my car to try and wrap, but that's okay. It looks good from a distance. I'm not expecting anybody to go, oh, you know, so that's good. If you've ever wondered what the secret is to those cars that look like they have glowing lines, well, the secret is, it's just this stuff. It's not anything glowing, fancy, extensive. It's just reflective tape. So when you shine a light on it, it does look like it's glowing. And it, it can make your car look really cool. 
That is the last thing I'm going to be doing to my car. We're gonna put this stuff all over it and it's gonna look real good. What I'm going to do is apply it in any place where there is uh, like a contour or anything that looks like it's been specifically bent or has got an edge to it because I like that look. But what you need to do to apply is just make sure your surface is clean. Just needs to be the surface you're applying to. Now I know I just washed my car, but it's dirty again. So it's best to make sure. Then you get some scissors, you measure out, and you cut too much. And that's it. I had a lot of fun with this video. I hope you have found something that you would like to do to your car. If not, I hope you were at least entertained. Thanks for coming and watching the video this far. My goal is to inspire you, so I hope I've accomplished that. Now we go to the outro.